Haven't you always wanted to make your own Ziploc bag out of saran wrap? Well, now you can. Today on TJ How To's, we will be making a Ziploc bag out of saran wrap. Yep. Things you will need for the, uh, the saran wrap Ziploc bag is saran wrap. Of course. Yep. Which yeah. we have a piece cut out already. Um, just about that size, if I put my hand up to it, right there. Now, you guys, it doesn't matter, it depends what you're putting in the Ziploc bag. Any size, that's the size we're using, because we are using strawberries. We have the two smallest ones, so. Yeah. And, uh, so yeah, that's the size we're using for these two strawberries. You also need, you know, we, we've done a bunch of water stuff in the past, but we, uh, we're just using the cap and the thing that you uh, screw on the cap at. Yeah, so let me see. So basically we just cut this off of a water bottle like this. I don't know how well you can see that, okay. And we just cut this off, so now you only have the part where you screw the cap on. And Pretty the cap, simple. of course. Yep. The cap and the part where you just screw the cap on. Pretty simple. You just cut that with a pair of scissors or a knife or something. And uh, that's what you should have left for, of your water bottle that you need. You don't need the rest of the water bottle. Okay, so the first thing you need to do, depending on the size of uh, the, I guess, substance you're putting in the Ziploc bag, you, uh, for us, since we're using the strawberries, we're going to put the strawberries in here first, not through here. So uh, you'll see what I mean in a sec. So we're just going to place the strawberries in the uh, saran wrap like so how well can you see that we're pretty we're good, good. And well, then you want to yeah and then you want to take it from corner to corner like this want to grab that corner Justin uh, yeah all right and then grab it and make sure that it's tucked in really tightly maybe give it a spin like so you want to keep some fluff at the end though, and you'll see why in a sec. So you can like spread it open like that. That, uh... <clears throat> okay, that, that no, turned out good. great. <laughs> so yeah, you just want to keep some uh, fluff at the end there, as you will see. <laughs> no, where's the water bottle? There right it is. Here, here's the water bottle. Okay, okay. so now you grab your... Uh, I guess where you put the cap on in your normal water bottle and you place this part right here through the bottom whoops well you like snag that so you just put it through like this which I'll bring the camera down so it's easier for you guys to see and for me to work yeah how's that how's that looking we're good yeah pretty good okay so then you put it through like this Move your hands out of the way, that would look even worse. Okay. Yeah. So now you have this. You have something that looks like that. You spread it open like this. Like I said before, you need that bit of uh, fluff. Not fluff, I don't even know. Uh, Access to saran wrap. Sure, like that. You fold it down like this. Fold it along the edge as best you can. Maybe give it another quick twist. Grab your cap. Twist your cap on. And boom. Airtight. Um, water, uh, well, I'm sorry, well, I guess, yeah, it's a water bottle, Ziploc bag, and saran wrap. That's uh... snap back up there. It doesn't look too pleasing to the eye, but I mean... <laughs> yeah, so it, uh, it's good. It works. <laughs> yeah, that was a quick tutorial on how to make your own... Uh... Did, you, did you forget you had a saran wrap on your forehead? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Completely gapped it. Thank you, Justin. You're welcome. I I forgot too.
Yeah. Well, yeah, that's... Okay. <laughs> so, yeah, this is what you should have afterwards. You know? Well, this if you're not using... Should be airtight. Depends how uh, much you twist it. and it might not be completely airtight. If, well, if you're not using two obscene ingredients that we did. Yeah, if you're using something <laughs> else than we did, this is the first thing we grabbed. If you're using liquid, liquid would work real well. Or if you're using not even stuff that needs to stay fresh, you're just trying to, say you opened a bag, like, say these balloons, and you want to keep it uh, together and tidy, basically just fold it up, put it in there so now it won't come undone and then the balloons won't fall everywhere. You can use it not just for storing uh, food and keeping it fresh, you can use it for any other things that doesn't need to stay fresh. Make water balloons out of it. Don't have any balloons, you just get saran wrap, make Actually, have that some could fun. work. Yeah, that could work. Yep. Okay. So, yeah, that was our quick tutorial on how to make your own uh, saran wrap Ziploc bag. Uh, as we say in most videos, uh, leave us a comment on what you think we should do next. Yep. Yeah. Uh, we do take requests. So just leave something down in the comments what uh, you want to see us doing in near uh, videos coming up. So, yeah, Justin, take us away. We are TJ How To's, and we're out. <laughs>